Non-contact infrared thermometers are some of the most common tools for temperature screening, but thermal cameras offer a lot of advantages over IR thermometers. Want to learn more about the differences between these tools? You'll find out in this video. First, thermal cameras will save you time compared to IR thermometers. They're much better suited to rapid screening in places like schools and large businesses where you need to screen a lot of people at once. Thermal camera systems allow operators to screen over a dozen subjects in just seconds. On the other hand, handheld IR thermometers or IR kiosk systems force people to stop for screening and often result in long screening lines. Here is an example of a reception area with a screening station. In this first example, the receptionist is using an IR thermometer. Straight away, you can see that the receptionist must stop everything she is doing, get up from her work, and then take the reading. Subjects must also get very close to the receptionist. Overall, the IR thermometer is slow to scan and disruptive for the operator. In this next example, the receptionist is using a thermal camera system. It's much faster to scan and far less disruptive for the operator. The receptionist only needs to glance at her screen to see the result of the scan. She doesn't need to get up or disrupt her work. Subjects can stand a few feet back from the desk, so social distancing is maintained. Thermal cameras also scan much faster than IR thermometers, so more people can enter the building in a shorter time. Second, despite the fact that most thermal cameras are more expensive than IR thermometers, you'll find that thermal cameras will actually save you money in the long run. Using non-contact infrared thermometers requires significantly more staff members to run the screening station, which is an additional cost for the business or school. Thermal cameras are much simpler to use and only require one employee to run the screening station. Third, thermal cameras will help you avoid bottlenecks and long lines at your screening station. Most thermal camera systems can read temperature almost instantly, so there's no waiting to take a reading. Thermal cameras will make your screening lines move much faster. That means you can keep people moving and prevent large crowds from building up, a crucial thing in the time of a pandemic. Fourth, thermal cameras document results, so you have a record of all persons you have screened. For businesses, this is crucial in the event that someone becomes sick. Having well-documented records means that your business is protected. You can easily search your results to find specific screening records with date, time, and temperature reading. That way you can prove that a person was screened and showed a normal or elevated temperature. Finally, Thermal cameras also help prevent measurement errors due to misuse. With infrared thermometers, operator errors can easily skew your readings. These tools must be held perfectly perpendicular to the subject's forehead at a specific distance, usually around six inches from the subject. If the angle and distance are wrong, your readings will be wrong too. Thermal camera systems are much easier to use. They have much longer screening ranges, typically from three to five feet. That means you can get accurate scans within a much wider range, and you don't need to stress about how you hold the camera. You can even mount it in a fixed location and have subjects approach from a specific point. Ultimately, thermal cameras are faster to screen, more cost-effective, and easier to use than IR thermometers. They will help you screen people much faster and with better accuracy than IR thermometers. If you have any further questions, please contact us at T-Equipment. We have experts on staff, 
ready to answer all your temperature screening questions.